Hey up guys, it's Farmer Daily here at Cannon Hall Farm. I hope you're all doing okay today. We have had the most wonderful new arrival. We've actually had quite a few calves born in the last um, few weeks. About the last two weeks, three weeks, we've had three or four calves born. Uh, they're all doing really, really well. Uh, but we actually only managed to catch one of the births on video. Or should I say... We very, very nearly did. Uh, Farmer Alex is going to explain that one to us. He's just waiting outside this wonderful little, um, it's a heifer calf, a, a girl calf, um, and it is pure white. It's absolutely lovely, and Alex was there the moment it was born, and he nearly did the perfect job catching it on video. Right, guys, so here we are. We're in with the, the rest of the short horns. Hey up, Jeremy. I didn't know you were there. <laughs> <laughs> now then, this lovely little calf that you can see behind Alex, wonderful little baby girl. Uh, she's doing really, really well. In fact, she's doing so well and she's so robust. She's already in with rested cows, which isn't necessarily something we'd always do. Um, so Alex, tell us about the birth. Right, so I came down last Friday. Um, so just a week ago today. Uh, came down into the pen. Um, I was actually coming to bed her up originally and we knew she was close to calving I thought I'd come down give her a bit more bedding uh, ready for when she starts Anyway, came down she started calving already So I could see the two front legs and the head so I knew she was progressing fairly well First thing I did was ring Dave Obviously, we'd like to have a natural birth, but if she's struggling uh, we'll get the calving in which we can use to help her um, By that time she would progressed even further and further so she started pushing and she would got pretty much half of the calf out at that point so I knew she was getting close at this time I was filming and then she had one last push and it got even closer to coming out now a lot of our cows calve when they lay down now this one she was stood up and I was unsure whether or not I was gonna risk the calf dropping all that way and carrying on filming so what I did was just as it were about to come out to calve obviously, uh, I stopped recording and I went in just to make sure that the calf was okay obviously as it had, uh, as it had fallen from that height. So uh, you missed the most critical moment but for the most critical reason. Exactly yeah, so unfortunately I missed the, the calving right at the crucial point but I'm sure you'll agree Dale though that um, at that point it's more important to make sure the calf's okay and, um, and we can save the filming for later. Absolutely. You are absolutely right, Alex. Uh, yeah, you did the perfect thing. You should, everyone's just seen the footage uh, of at the top of this video, so you can, uh, you can decide for yourself whether or not you think Alex made the right decision. And I think we all know the answer. 99% uh, that calf would have been all right, but it's not worth it for the 1% of it dropping onto the floor and falling at a funny angle. So a good move uh, by Alex. Quite interestingly though, this little calf, I'm gonna do a zoom up, this little calf, who's, uh, who's now pure white, and we don't get that many pure white short arms. It's, a, it's relatively rare. Most of ours uh, are rowing or a, or a different mix of colours. But she's pure white. She's absolutely beautiful. But when she was born, she was pretty much bright yellow. She had the fluid inside the sack that she was born in was particularly yellow, even more than, than normal, I'd say. I'll, what did, I, I was looking, I'm thinking... I'm not actually 100% sure what colour this calf is just yet. Yeah, it were quite hard to, uh, to to spot it really. Like you said, the fluid was so yellow, it, it had uh, tainted the, the colour of the calf almost. So we weren't, we weren't sure. And then obviously she started to clean the calf. We could start to see that, yeah, she's that she's that lovely bright white colour. Yeah, mum mum, mum had a right job on it. We're like, yeah. she, she knew, I think she knew what were under there. You know, it yeah. were like sand, <laughs> taking down some old wallpaper or sanding. Yeah, she knew there was something beautiful under there, but she had to do some serious cleaning to get down to it. So, yeah, an absolutely wonderful new arrival at the farm, which we thought you might like to see. Right, guys, so from me, Farmer Dale, and from Farmer Alex. Alex. Hey, oh. <laughs> and <laughs> from our brand new lovely calf, who looks to have made a mate with his half brother or sister already. We'll see you later, and thanks very much for watching. I'll see you guys. Ta da.